And the weaknesses you see are very common. You know, the, the flaws in businesses are very common. You know, everyone talks about imposter syndrome. See it all the time. People running successful businesses who think someone's going to catch them out one day because <laughs> they're making it up as they go along. And we say, we're all making it up as we go along. So very common issues. Uh, in fact, one of the exercises we run for uh, businesses, we have a little, we call it the rocket diagram, a little um, triangle. And it says a business must have a vision. Business must have a strategy, a structure, a culture. Somebody should be driving products and services, sales and marketing, finance, people, you know, systems, etc. Uh, so a very simplistic model of what a business needs to get right. And you go into a family business or a business with uh, multiple people involved in it. And you go, right, who's in charge of products and services? And two hands go up. You go, we can't both be in charge of it. You know? <laughs> well, I thought I was in charge of it. Or you get finance, no one's hands go up. Nobody wants to deal with that. So in quite large businesses, you deal, you do find this absence of clarity of who's in charge of what and what their job descriptions are. Um, so, yeah, I think the problems are the same. They're just different scales, different cycles of a business. But when they say, oh, yeah, but not in my business. No, it's, it's in every business. The issues are the same.